Hi, it's Miranda. I'll try to talk loud enough because of the fan. Not much I can do about that. I'll show you how to do this in the dark. Let's see what it looks like. Actually, this works. If you don't mind, I don't mind. I'll do it in the dark. I can, I can see enough. Kind of. I've got bad night vision. It looks better here than it actually does in reality. A little bit of this. I'm not gonna pretend that I haven't noticed that my hair has been looking a, a bit wispy. But like when I do anything, it just looks so wispy in the... Here's the rest of it. I'm so scattered. Hi. I'm not touching any of this. That's why it's tied. It's not tied back because I'm going to cut it. It's tied back because I'm not touching it. So there's no length change in the back. I just think because this has been looking a little damaged for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it just needs a trim. I'm gonna give it more of a trim than the tiny little bit of a trim that I gave it during my last buzzes. Tie it up. Because <laughs> the only reason I did this, I know it looks silly, but the only reason I did it is because these sides, because they're getting so long, they kind of just kept doing this little horn thing in front. Like they just kept doing this and I just wasn't liking that. So I realized when I do this, as long as I sweep some hair over it, it actually makes more sense than this little that looks okay. This looks funny, but you know, <laughs> it's gonna look funny for a while. I have to make it kind of work and kind of look like I did it on purpose. So let's get all this hair up. I'm just gonna brush it all up. I might end up not buzzing my sides for a while. I don't really know what I'm gonna do. So everyone calls this type of thing a like unicorn cut or a wolf cut or something. Some people kind of just do things on their own naturally just to, to be efficient and save themselves time and then later on people give it names online and you're just like, I do weird things like that. That's interesting. Like, I didn't know people would like that, but then you start thinking back and like, what else do I do? <laughs> I'm gonna put this on the crown, not the very front, but the top. The front hairs to not be too short. How long are these front pieces? Okay, these front pieces are about this long anyway, so I don't want to make those shorter. So, even if I cut about an inch off my hair, it'll make a big difference. What do I want to cut? I want to see those bang pieces. I want to see where they are. There are the bangs. Is that a bad idea? It might be. Want to find out with me? Let's find out. There's a little bit of an angle, see that's what happened. Uh, I think some piece in the back of it on the short side, so hopefully... Because you have to think, it's not just this short, it's this plus this. <laughs> like a little fountain. Hopefully this curls up too because I've just had a problem with my curls lately. Okay, I think this will, it looks funny now, but it'll make more sense. I'm, I'm gonna wash my hair right now. Should I do a transition? Should I do like this or, hmm. Do something with the scissors. Oh. Okay, I thought maybe it might be a good idea to use a spin brush because this is, it's taking a little while. So I hope you don't mind. I'll mute this part because you don't need to hear it. It's loud. Here we go. Um, I don't know about you. I love it when I cut my hair and I look like I have more hair. A little bit wet in some spots too, just a tiny little bit. I cut this much hair off. I don't know if the light shining behind me is helping my case, but it legitimately looks thicker in person. I use the spin brush and it tends to give me the thing that it does. And also, I've got lots of gray hairs. 
but lots of silver and white and glittery hair. So if you don't know what that's like, sometimes those hairs are a little wiry and they just try to do the opposite of what everything else is doing. Sometimes. But lots of silver and white and glittery hair. So if you don't know what that's like, sometimes those hairs are a little wiry and they just try to do the opposite of what everything else is doing. Sometimes. Once in a while, you do something like this and you like the way your hair looks and you're like, oh, this looks nice, I like it. And you have one hair just a bing. Just doesn't want to cooperate. I just wanted my hair to look like it was actually trying to be something and not, well, I don't know. You can't, so you can't, there you go. Hi. But no.